So the uh, first semi-final then is out on court. Alex Miotto in the blue, nearest us on the TV screen against Testing. Matt Gollidge, who has, uh, of course, just walked off court. Miotto's had probably over an hour, I'd say, with his feet up. So it's uh, important for him to start quickly. But, of course, now we have reached the semi-final stage. It is back to the normal best of three. So a little more time for these players just to uh, become invested in the match. Oh, we've got Alan on the umpire mic now as well, which adds a nice <laughs> edge to this one. Things getting serious now at the, uh, the Shiva yep. Coffee Masters Cup. Yeah, you don't think there's going to be too many lengthy rallies in this no. one. Certainly watching Alex Miotto throughout the, uh, the course of the evening. The serve has been, this, this three, yeah. quite frankly, ridiculous at times. Uh, it's going to be first strike touch tennis, I think, in this one. One minute, guys. They've played each other three times One previously. It's uh, Alex Miotto who's won all three. So history not quite on Matt Gollidge's side. They've met once earlier this year. It came actually just a few weeks ago in Cranley when Alex Miotto won comfortably 4-2-4-1. Not far from here. No. That was at the, the semi-final stage. And they met twice last year as well. The Tile Masters Cup, which uh, Miotto won in three sets there and also... In Portsmouth okay. last year Time, guys. in February again, which Miotto won in three. Yeah, time called on the, the warm-up. We're going to get spin? underway here. As Adam drops yeah. his drink. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's an empty drink. That's good news. That was a bonus. That is a Great. relief. Ladies and gentlemen, to the left of the chair, Alex Miotto. To the right of the chair, Matt Gollidge. Alex Miotto's won the toss and is elected to serve. So if you've not seen this guy serve before... Look out. <laughs> Play. <laughs> no surprise, he's choosing to serve first it. Line ball. That was okay, says the, line the umpire. It was on the line. Can make a few errors behind the line serve, ball, yeah. though. We saw that uh, in his final love. group stage game. He made back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back errors off the serve. 30 love. Of course, uh, with the touch tennis system not uh, allowing a second serve, it does just put that slight more pressure on the, uh, the serve. I mean, when you can serve like that, it's that <laughs> risk reward, 40 isn't it? I mean, he's got to, to go for that big weapon because it is such a, a devastating shot. So there will be errors sometimes. But Out. on the flip side, you can play a game like that and <laughs> game waste Otto. very little energy. So that Miotto leads one game to love, first set. So far for Miotto, very quick service game. Just what the doctor ordered to get this semi-final underway here. And actually, as a receiver in this venue, Mikey, it's quite tough, isn't yeah. it, against Miotto because you can see... Just behind yep. the court, there's not actually a love. huge amount of room to, to kind of stand back and give yourselves a little more time to try and return the Miotto serve. Probably only, what, two, three kind of big steps back. Yeah, so you really have to, love. to step in, and that obviously takes time away and makes that return pretty difficult for these, uh, these two players here. Best of three sets, just to remind you, not like the, 40 love. the group stage matches, which were quick fire and they were... They were one set affairs. This is back to normal, really. Well, this could be one of the quickest game, Yotto. One three game all. setters we've ever seen <laughs> Hold here. Hold on two sets, guys. Two sets. Right. Just start the stopwatch. Let's have a look. There's uh, Alan. He's uh, <laughs> losing his microphone. It's, it's all happening here. <laughs> He's got it back under control, I think. Great return from Matt Gollis there, read the serve. And has that just put Love. a few doubts Love 30. in the world number one's mind here? Oh, oh nearly <laughs> made another. It wasn't 15, holding back 30. there, it was, it was Gollidge. Trying to get himself out of trouble here. Deserves huge credit for getting all. that serve back. That was a monster serve. 
And we've been playing outside, Adam, as we've <laughs> been mentioning earlier, we're having a go at the serving. It's pretty tough to get a serve back, and that's one of our serves. I mean, yeah, 40, 30. <laughs> yeah, half, the pace, <laughs> half the pace of these guys. <laughs> Oh dear. Juice. Signing point, receiver's choice. This is a big chance. Well, no surprise he's chosen this side because he's made two errors on the yeah. serve from that side. No mistake there though. Game, Miotto. Miotto leads on two on games to one, two one. First set. Yeah, good start to this semi final. Pretty decent level and the both players serving pretty well. Of course, Miotto very quick in that first service game. This second service game for him took a little. Detour. A bit of encouragement for Golic though in that so, previous yeah. game. The fact that he took him to juice. Definitely got a, a look in on the, the Miotto service game, which doesn't happen too often. But now he's got to try and hold his own serve here. That's what I was doing with my forehand. 15 love. Yeah, dropping that was, it, that dropping was it into the net. Pereira, that. <laughs> classic Pereira error. <laughs> Still, I do encourage everyone to go watch the Instagram live story of my volley. <laughs> I mean, one of my love. sporting highlights, I think. Can you my, see it? Of can my you actually see it on the volley? On, uh, on the video, sorry. You, you can, yeah. Oh, you can. And you can the see your, your reaction, the applause, <laughs> the gasp. <laughs> the gasp. <laughs> I mean, you fired it at me at the net, and I just it killed it dead. It was genuinely I? outrageous. Killed it dead. Yeah. Deep. Very impressive. <laughs> <laughs> Even if you say so yourself. <laughs> well, I'm asking for a bit of help with this one. Oh, out. It's out. Okay. Service is out. 30 15. Well, oh, that's what a return. 30 all. Out wide. Very awkward here. There's not a lot of space to <laughs> deal with. And yes, he gets a little bit of luck with the net core, but I'll tell you what, he earned that luck. Just getting a racket on it. That's a good comeback serve. 40 there from 30. College. Another close game, though. And that one. How's that? Looks so like wide. wide. Cut. I couldn't see, to be honest, guys. Yeah, I thought it was wide. Wide. Juice. So deciding point. Chance he'd got into the rally. Game Gollidge. Gollidge survives. Two games all. Stay on first serve. Set. Two games all. Yeah, that's a that was a nervy point, a tense point that one, and you could just feel that the importance on that particular rally. And like you say, Miotto, Wait. that's a, a huge Love chance 15. because he did get into the rally. Excellent play from Gollidge to uh, to come through that game. Back against the ball, not easy. Wow. <laughs> it's just turned to, to where we're sitting. 15 said, Wow. <laughs> that ripped up. Oh, he's got it. 15-30. From Matt Gollich. Did well to uh, actually get the serve back as well as it clipped the net on the way through. Thirty all. He's had a pretty lucrative career on the uh, the touch tennis tour as Alex Miotto. Out. Nearly 4,770 £4, pounds in his career. Nine singles titles. Three slams and uh, two masters. <laughs> Golo just fired that at. <laughs> game Golo, at uh, Alan, game Miotto, sorry. Miotto leads three games to two. First set. Miotto with uh, another service <laughs> hold, and it's all on serve so far, this one. Just looking at Miotto's record. Has he won in La Manga before? Has he travelled? 
out to the sunshine of Spain. We're trying to get Rash to take us out there, aren't we? Yes, without I mean, a huge <laughs> amount of success so far. <laughs> we keep on asking. <laughs> Wait. Love 15. Yeah, as nice as Guildford is. <laughs> the Lamanga of, <laughs> of Surrey. There's a few that I... Yeah, he won uh, Lamanga last year. Yeah, I did, thought he did. Uh, Miotto. 15-0. I think he likes travelling abroad, actually. He won the Valladolid Castilla y Leon Slam earlier this year. I think my pronunciation was... Very good. Very impressive. <laughs> he tried to <laughs> just 30, come up with 15. something a little bit special there, Miotto, but uh, not quite able to pull that one out of the bag. Yeah, the net just took it in a completely <laughs> opposite direction there. Oh, how's your luck? That could 30 be a big all. point. <laughs> can hear the reaction from the, the gallery upstairs. <laughs> That one's wide, oh so here's an opportunity. 30-40. Had one in the previous Gollage serve when he got to the deciding point. Well, he's going to have two looks here. Juice. Sudden death, receiver's choice. Juice side. Dead point if it hits the roof, of course. Yeah, that's big tennis. Game, Again, Gollage. From Matt Gollage. Three Coming games all. up big when he needs it. It's a, a tie break we need in this very first set of the first semi final. Fifteen love. Fifteen all. Thirty fifteen. We've jumped the gun there, Adam. It's not a tie break. Tie break at four four. Yep, away. Thirty all. And the Otto's certainly not rolling through his service games as he was in the group stage. Forty thirty being put under more pressure, still finding ways through it at the moment. That's a good lead. Game, Miotto. So Miotto. Miotto leads four games to three, four first three. set. Once more, a little bit of pressure will be on the shoulders of Matt Gollage to try and hold serve here. But he's done pretty well when he's had that pressure. Time and time again, he's had to play catch up just because Miotto has been serving first. So he has had that little bit of pressure to contend with, but he's been okay dealing with it. So he doesn't look under the weather, does he? Have no. Does he Maybe he's getting the excuses in early Possibly, to us, yeah. you know. Maybe he was scared of losing to me, actually, on the practice court. I don't think he was. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's just, just long. I think it's 15 tricky. love. To attempt to lob against either of these guys. These tall players, both over six foot. Thirty love. Forty love. Line ball. these Away. serves when you step 40, in. 15. I think it's just been just called out. out. Yeah. 
again. Got into Game. the rally, Gollidge. Alex Miotto, and then just four games all tie break. Matt Gollidge off the hook, so we do head to a tie break now. You feel it's more important for Matt Gollidge, don't you, to come through this? The fact that they've played each other three times previously, and Gollidge has come out on the losing side all three times. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, the first good. set, if you one, can get that, one love will be Miotto. A, a huge boost for him. If, if he does lose his first set, having put so much effort into it, I mean, it's a pretty long set. This one, even though they. One all. Have been pretty quick points. It will be a bit of a hammer blow. And he'll be thinking, oh dear, are we just going to go through the same thing again? Oh, oh yes. Oh. Shot of the day from Alex Miotto. That is Two, outrageous. One, Miotto. Well, that's the reason he is the number one. Absolute piece of magic in college. There's not much to be done about that. If you've got a two-handed backhand, that would have been easier because you can kind of wrap that left wrist around it. But to hit a shot like that with a one-hander is, well, almost Three, impossible. Three, one, Yotto. Yeah, and that's a bit of a blow as well with the, the neck cord on the way through. Is this just slipping away from, from Matt Gollidge? Four, one, Miotto. Well, he's criticising himself with the back of the court there, Golly. That was a pretty big <laughs> serve from it's Miotto. A, a little bit harsh on himself. Not sure there. what he was expecting. Not sure what you could possibly do with that sort of serve. Game and first so set, first Miotto. Set Five games to four. Alex Miotto. It was very closely contested. Both players had their chances, but as has seemingly been the way when these two have met. In uh, previous years, it has ultimately gone the way of the world number one. A good fun this so far, and that's, as we said, I think that's going to be a real disappointment for, for Gollidge. He had chances, certainly, in that set. Alex Miotto, though, time and time again, has had a good positive result uh, against Matt Gollidge, and that sort of magic from the back of the court, I mean, that actually looks Second set, does. Gollidge said, to serve. <laughs> what can I do with that? Play. Shaking his head. We didn't really have the answers for Matt. But perhaps he's going to find himself yeah. just coming forward 15 a bit love. more. Perhaps just mixing things up. Nice short, sharp point there again. Let's try and put that first set behind him. It's going to be difficult. 30 love. He gave that a lot. But now he's just got to be clear in his mind. He's got to win the next two sets. And he's into the final. Out. 30, 15. Yeah, he's just mixing up his return position. Alex Miotto trying to take it a little earlier. <laughs> 40, <laughs> really 15. Is so little room to the side and to the back of this court. Very, very difficult for these players. You hit that kind of kicker out wide like we've just seen Gollidge hit. That's game it. Miotto. And, uh, just the start. Sorry, correction. Game Gollidge. Matt Gollidge wanted to Gollidge uh, leads kick off one this second game set. to love. Miotto, one set to love. Oh, yeah. Neatly done. Love, 15. Who do you think has got the strongest serve of, of these two here tonight? I've oh, got to go Miotto. Yeah. Have to, I think. <laughs> and it's just the confidence he has just to hit it big every time. So a lot of the time, Love Goddard 30. will just take a bit off it, but Miotto is just 100% every serve. But he's got a chance here, Gollidge. Love 30. That was good. Good. Yeah. Would you rather have 15, Miotto's 30. serve or Hassan's movement? <laughs> <laughs> having played for a couple of hours tonight. I think I think the serve. 30 all. Just because you can rattle through it. Mm. You imagine think you've got the movements already. Imagine Hass, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Athleticism's no issue. <laughs> the serve is though. <laughs> imagine Adam Hassan with uh, 40, 30. Stop serve. it. Stop it. <laughs> He 
because he can just quickly bail game yourself out of Mioto. trouble just like that. Love 30 down. Found four enormous One game serves. all. And quick as a flash is one game all. Yeah, very effective. Makes it look pretty simple. Why don't we uh, compose our the ultimate touch tennis <laughs> player? So serve. Of everyone. Everyone. Not just here tonight. No, not just here. Away. Um, I think Love the Otto. 15. Yeah. Who else would you throw in the mix? I think Gollage. Yeah, Gollage is up there. We're just picking the big guys here, aren't we? Yeah. Willis. Yeah. Love, 30. Yeah, he's got to be careful here, Gollage, because he got to love 30 in the previous game, wasn't able to break, and now all of a sudden it's Miotto asking questions. Just needs to be careful love here, not 40. to unravel. Only take it from Roberts. <laughs> Fifteen forty. Determination. Definitely defence from Roberts. His trophies. His trophy cabinet, yeah. <laughs> the winning mentality. Yeah. Thirty forty. Only take it from the goat. From Rash. <laughs> I quite like the, the one-handed one backhand. The, the one-handed backhand, the and attitude. And the, the sheer belief. The showmanship. <laughs> Juice. Sun death. What's the player choice. we're making here? <laughs> My Juice goodness. Side. Could be an absolute animal on tour. Well, again, it was Game, a tentative Gullage. rally from both, but from Love 40 down, what a hold that is from Gullage Matt Gullage. Two games to one. And we stay Second on serve, 2-1. Miotto by one set gutsy. to Love. Gutsy. That really <laughs> was very gutsy indeed. How well he's done to, to come through that game. More often than not, when one of those extended rallies has developed, it has gone the way of Gollage today. Seen a few errors from uh, Miotto. Just thinking we need more... More things from other touch tennis players. How about the, the star power of Miranda Hart? <laughs> <laughs> Certainly. The following. The following of Miranda Hart. Yeah, the fans. The survival skills of, of Bear, Bear Grylls. Yeah. Forehand of Fernando Gonzalez. Yeah, that's definitely there. 15 that love. Up there. What a player we're making. <laughs> oh, he did well too. Get that back, Gollage. 15 all. Thirty fifteen. Oh, amazing hands from Alex Miotto. 40 15. He's not making too many mistakes at the moment, Alex Miotto. Wrong side, sorry. Out. Really? Yep. Oh, yeah. Yep. Yep. 40 30. Okay. Nicely done. Game Miotto. Two games all. Well, you look at Alex Miotto's record over the last 52 weeks, it's just extraordinary. Played 28, won 27, and lost just the one. <laughs> 15, love. Adam Hassan, the man, to beat him earlier this year. 
the uh, the Rackets Masters back in June. Out. Thirty love. Thirty fifteen. Thirty all. Well, well, there was the right idea to come forward. Thirty forty. A great angle with that inside out forehand, and then just snatched at the volley. So more opportunities here for Alex Miotto. Oh, he took it so early. It was just Juice. long. Sudden death. Receiver's choice. Juice side. Yes. Oh, what a serve. He has pulled out of the bag. Game. A Golic. From the Golic hat. leads three games to two. Second set. First set, Miotto. And again, he's just doing enough. College time and time again to keep Alex Miotto at arm's length. Yeah, it's almost when the, the pressure gets on Golic, he finds his best touch tennis. Oh, this is very tasty. This semi final, remember, we still have a, another semi final to come after Hassan against Paling. Adam Hassan against Mikey Paling. Fifteen love. Well, at the moment, it looks as though we may well be heading to the inevitable tie break once more. <laughs> Fifteen all. Just a whisker away. Out. Only just. 30, 15. I mean, this is serious pace that he's raining down these serves. I just can't understand how you lay a racket on it, let alone get it back into play. There's another monster. 40, 15. I mean, there's so little time to react in this game. And there I we go. Line. There is line no ball. returning that one. Game, Miotto. It's another game. Easy Three as you like for Alex Miotto. Every service game college has now. There's just that bit extra pressure because he knows one break of serve. That's probably his race run. That's big. Love 15. Nice thrill. Yep. And the auto's getting just as confused, Mikey. He thought it was a tie break now. Indeed. That one's long, so again, love 30. not for the first time today. Alex Miotto gets to love 30. <laughs> and not for the first time Out. in this set. Love 40. Alex Miotto gets to love 40. Can Golidge perform yet another escape act here. Fifteen, forty. Away. Thirty, forty. That's another very important moment here for Golic. 
Out. Away. There's another big point Juice. coming here, though. Sudden death. Receiver's choice. Juice side. This is infuriating for Alex Miotto here. <laughs> it's another Out. one that goes long. And for the second Game, time in Miotto. this set, Matt Gollidge sorry. comes back Baker, from low 40 Game down. Gollidge. Gollidge so leads four games to three. Leads second four, three. set. Miotto, a one set to love. serve that hits the, the net cord that I think is the hardest to get back. I mean... It smashes into the net and then goes over. And there's so much to look at in it, a split second. You're not sure where exactly the ball is. I think that's much harder than just the ball coming down hard into the, the service box. That is so tricky. Yeah, it's something that uh, the next gen actually uh, introduced, yep. didn't they, a couple of years ago. They took it away this they year, did. though. I think that was wise. <laughs> <laughs> it was causing carnage for them in, uh, in Milan. <laughs> But I think touch tennis, it really does work on this size of court. It still gives you a chance to, to get a play on the ball. That's outstanding. 15 From love. Miotto at the net. Yeah, because you don't really get kind of dead net courts, do you, off the serve in touch tennis, no. whereas in tennis it can just clip the net and just dribble over the other side. <laughs> I'll just I say that. <laughs> 30 love. Well, that worked out. Don't often see that just rolling along the ground. Thirty fifteen. Well, it's hot work in that the players are actually steaming. <laughs> we can <laughs> see the steam rising off the way. Thirty all. Yeah, because we are basically just in a barn, yeah. so it's actually quite cold it's on the. A court. little cool in there, but they are sweating so much, and as a result, they <laughs> are literally steaming. <laughs> Forty thirty. Game, Miotto, four games all, so tie break. Yet another tie break between these two. It was uh, Miotto who took the opening set on a breaker. And that is not the start that he wanted. 1-0, Miotto. I just hear him saying, <laughs> it doesn't need to be that big. That's just the pressure that Miotto puts you under, though. That's nice, Sir uh, Volley. But this is when he becomes so ice cool. 2-0, Miotto. This is my chance. Okay, I can get this done in straight sets. And I've never lost to, to Matt Gollidge, so why should I start now? And Alex Miotto looking good so far. And that is a wonderful pickup. 3-0, Miotto. Serves up a gift at Christmas time. It's a bit like when you came to the net against me earlier. I just you panicked. You just can't deal with it, Adam. <laughs> I've seen it time and time again. <laughs> Okay, well, he stops the rot. 3-1, Miotto. Yeah, I certainly know how to get in your head on the touch tennis court. <laughs> <laughs> Scamper forward to the net. <laughs> I don't actually think I won one point, did I, when you came <laughs> to the net? <laughs> Maybe not. In fairness, you were winning most of the baseline battles. So I tried to mix it up. <laughs> from Matt Gollidge, who's just staying in touch in this tie break. 3-2, Miotto. Oh, enormous. 4-2, Miotto. Is not coming back, and uh, Alex Miotto is on the verge of booking his spot in yet another final. Yeah, and is it going to be a, another semi-final exit for Gollidge here? He said he wanted to get to the semi-finals. He's done that, coming through the group stage. And there we go. Game, well, he's set, won his match. Four Miotto. touch tennis events, says Alex Miotto. And uh, on the evidence of what we've seen so far today, you wouldn't be at all surprised if he made it five. five he four, increases five, four. his head-to-head -head advantage over Matt Gollidge to 4-0. Oh, and, oh. and he comes through in straight sets, 5-4, five, 5-4. Four, five, four. Yeah, fun match. It really was very impressive and two tight sets, both going to a tie break.
Just what we wanted to see, really, between these two impressive players. Big striking. Serve was very important, as we thought. Not just It wasn't just a, a serving exchange, a serving battle. There was some wonderful touches around the net. Good play around the baseline as well. And to Alex Miotto, well, he's going to be tough to beat. And he can just put his feet up for just a few minutes. I, I can't imagine he'll relax too much. He might want to stay warm and just get a drink. Very generous drinks that Rash has put on here. And <laughs> yeah, he will uh, Mine's have all over his the floor. But we've got another bag, sorry, great yeah. semi final to come here. Has yeah. against uh, Paley. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think it's going to be interesting this for, for us, Adam, because we've seen a lot more of. Adam Hassan over the last few Guys, years. But, uh, Mikey Paling, less so. Spin, spin now quickly, yeah. But uh, there we can see the result of that first semi final. Alex Miotto coming through in a couple of tie break sets, 5 4, 5 4. And he is the first finalist here at the, the Sheba Coffee Masters Cup. We need another finalist. Yes, will it be Adam Hassan? Will it be Michael Paling? And uh, this one, Mikey, will be completely different to the match that we've just seen. Yeah, I, I think it will be. And it's, it just kind of shows how different styles of touch tennis can win matches. Adam Hassan really is rock solid around the baseline. Doesn't give too much away. I think it's a similar story, really, for, for Michael Paling, Mikey Paling. And it should be fascinating to see. Obviously, I think we've got to say Adam Hassan is uh, the favourite for this one. Has had a bit more experience at these sorts of events, and he's he's won a lot of events like this. But Paling certainly will not be making this easy for him tonight. He's done well to get through the group stage and book his place in, in the semi-final. I just wonder if Paling has just cooled down a bit, because it's been... What, an hour and a half since he's yeah, played? Yeah, at least, Maybe, maybe a couple of hours yeah. since he was... Because he was playing in the first kind of lot of group matches. That group was played first. And and I just wonder if he's stayed warm. This warm-up, this couple of minutes of warm-up will be very important for him just to try and to get up to speed because Adam Hassan, he has been the player who's played more recently. Yeah, amazingly, this is the, the first time that these two have met, actually, on okay. the, the Touch time. Tennis Tour. Adam Hassan, number two in the world, Michael Paling at 12. And he's got that Brian, who won rather that? unorthodox uh, technique, Michael Paling. We were chatting to him earlier. Ladies Mike and gentlemen, it's the second semi-final of the Masters Cup 2019. Normal tennis, to the left of the chair, Adam Hassan. To the right, Mikey Paling. Mikey won the toss, and Adam is serving first. Play. So Hassan is going to kick this one off. Out. But yeah, you can just see with that shot there, love. he hits the two-handed forehand and the two-handed backhand. He has to kind of ch quickly change grips. C certainly on the return, he was saying. He's actually customized his racket <laughs> as well. <laughs> he <laughs> gives himself a, a longer grip. He puts grip kind of higher up than you'd expect on, 30 on other touch tennis rackets. Just to give himself a chance to make that kind of movement with the hands, the maneuvering of the hands quickly. Yeah, gives himself a little bit more space. I don't know whether we'll be Out. able to see it, but I think he 40 said he's even love. put an extra little grip on kind of the throat of the racket yeah. as well. But you can just see it. There's just a little bit of extra tape there. No, he said when he when he started playing game. all Hassan. those years ago, first game. he first picked up a tennis racket. He just said it was too heavy for him, so he actually needed two hands to, to be able to pick up the racket and hit decent shots, and he's just never got out of that habit. That was when he was much younger. <laughs> much <laughs> younger. <laughs> yeah. It wasn't a couple of years ago the tennis Love racket was too heavy. This was when he was a kid. I mean, there's not much of it. Just to, <laughs> just to give himself some uh, a bit of a chance there. Love 30. And he was t yeah, telling us all about the, this, this kind of interesting style he does have.
that's nice. Good little exchange 15, there 30. with the, the two players and Paling just had to be wary. Hassan creeping forward there, scampering up to the net. At least that serve to get going. 30 here, Paling, because he's going to have to try and get some free points. Does not want to get stuck into too many long rallies with Adam Hassan. This is a very important game for, 30, for Paling. 40. If he loses this game, he might just think, oh dear, here we go. Because Hassan, he just looks in mean mood here tonight. Yeah, he sure does. And uh, I agree with you that he really needs this serve to start heating Away. up. I think that one's wide. And Adam Hassan off to the dream game. start. Hold Hassan. serve and then breaks immediately. Two love. Two games to love. And that. You would. Yeah, you genuinely weren't sure whether to hit a one-hander <laughs> or a two-hander. And then it, it actually became abundantly obvious that Which you were a one-hander. <laughs> hitting it beautifully <laughs> by Out. the end. 30-15. Very kind. So on the tennis court, what do you hit? Two. A two. All oh, right. 40, 15. Not anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I might try something else. <laughs> this is getting a bit ugly, this set, for, for Mikey Paling. That's beautifully done Game from Hassan. Adam Hassan, who has started like a train. Hassan here. leads Only about three games five to love. Played, First and he's set. already three love up. Yeah, racing through it. He has uh, not really let his foot off the gas here, Hassan. just think this could be pretty tricky for, uh, for Mikey Paling. I think it was the final that a lot of people expected before this tournament started. Adam Hassan and uh, Alex Miotto. And at the moment, it looks as though that's the final we're going to get. Love 15. And the record for Adam Hassan against Alex Miotto is not good, to put it lightly. Played each other nine Out. times. Alex Love Miotto 30. has won eight of them. Out. 15.30. They've played a lot this year as well. So they've uh, shared a court many times this year. Oh, wait. Uh, 15.40. Played in the final of Cranley just a few weeks ago, towards the end of November. So with good memories in that one. 30-40. Rapid. 4-2-4-1 four, four, that final. Out. Receives choice, juice side. Well, looked wide, was it? Yep. No, it's been called in, so... Game, Paling. Michael Paling saves the bagel at least. Hassan leads three games to one. Hassan will now serve for the opening set. Fifteen love. That is bread and butter. Thirty love. That sort of point. I think it's actually slightly underrated the, the Hassan serve. We're talking about all the big guys. I mean he's got a really good serve, so much top spin on it. You take Hassan's serve 40 over love. Yeah, why not? <laughs> I could use the lefty serve. That's going to make it very awkward for you in returning. Game well, and first set, Hassan. For Adam Hassan. Four games to one. 
Just getting a, a bit of a lesson here on just how difficult it is to take on the world number two. 4 1 in the blink of an eye. Yeah, tough work so far. As uh, Adam Hassan is just looking like he's got an eye on the final already. He did mention to us earlier, Mikey, that perhaps fitness isn't one of his great strengths. Because he was talking about a doubles match that we commentated on that we were apparently uh, ripping him for his fitness. And Mikey Paling this. Michael Paling, yeah, yeah, he was. And he said um, we might actually see something similar here today. So possibly is just feeling it physically. I think I do remember that. I can't remember where it was, though. No, I can't. Somewhere sunny. Was it that day at Weybridge? Live 15. <laughs> the hottest day of the year. The hottest day ever. <laughs> Goodness me. We were sweating in the commentary <laughs> box. Marcus Willis was out there for about eight hours. Yeah. The only person that wasn't affected by it was Grills. <laughs> Bear Grills could have played all that. night. <laughs> Love 30. There's no stopping him. Out. 15-30. Oh, he's got to start well here, Paling. If he gets broken first game, difficult to see a way back. Oh, that's wild. Out. 15-40. If he gets broken here, it would be one of the great comebacks. <laughs> if we can wriggle out of this one. No. Out. 30-40. Too good. Outstanding from Hassan. And he game just Hassan. did so well First to game, deal with the net call that Hassan came into the rally. He didn't to love. panic. He didn't kind of get too frantic there. He just kept us cool. That's what you have to do when you get the net cords because they do come a lot in this game. And he just really dealt with it well. And that is the break. And now things are looking very tricky indeed for Paley. It's just super from Adam Hassan, just 15, using love. the dimensions of the court. Well, he does use the thirty love. so well. All around the court, Adam Hassan uses every centimetre. Great angles. I'm sure he was excellent at trigonometry at school. Just not missing right now, Adam Hassan. 40, love. How's your maths at school? Um, not ideal. <laughs> <laughs> More of a word. It was <laughs> very much so. It wasn't, uh, wasn't a strength of mine. Took my B at GCSE and ran fairly right swiftly. Home. Yeah. Game Hassan. Hassan leads so two games to love. On well, his one merry set way to love. to love. Alex Miotto, by the looks of things, isn't going to have too long to rest up for this final. 15 love. Hammered the ball back at Hassan. 30, that love. course is absolutely A-OK -okay in this game. Yeah, at least you know it's not going to hurt <laughs> with the foam balls. Out. 40, love. So you have a straight 
frustrating um, it is for Adam Hassan. Every single ball that he misses, furious with himself. Out. Game. Paling. So, Paling off and running. In set Hassan two, leads still two games to no one. Second set. And a break. One it's set a long to way back. Quite late into the evening now. Not far off. Half past ten. Play started here at about half six earlier this evening, so it's been quite a long evening. Friday night in Guildford. Same, same yeah, as the corner. Times. Lively. Yeah, you uh, entered a rather nice establishment, didn't you, earlier on? Yeah, nearby. Had a nice bowl of pasta before this, before this <laughs> encounter tonight. Nearby village. Yeah, it's safe to say this uh, venue that we're at isn't somewhere that you just stumble upon. <laughs> Really yes. is in the, the middle of nowhere. Down a few windy roads. Yeah. And once you get here, what a magic place. <laughs> Fifteen love. <laughs> a touch tennis haven. <laughs> it really is that they've created here. A little touch tennis paradise. Oh, sorry. It's an Thirty love. Sporting excellence in the Surrey Hills. Yeah, renowned for their golf, the Surrey Hills, but uh, I think touch tennis isn't too far behind. It's a very good golf course nearby. Brandy 40 love. Club. Played it? I have, a couple of times. It's down the road. You beat me the other week on my home course. You give away a lot of shots, though. I mean, you're a much better player than I am with my uh, modest 18 handicap. You're playing off five. Game, Still Hassan. Home course. It was your home course, and I did you down the Hassan 18. Hassan leads three <laughs> so, uh, games to one. I was set. delighted about that. One, one of the great finishing holes in golf in Chepstow, South Wales. St. Pierre. Lovely day it was. Oh. Yeah, you still owe me dinner for that one. Oh, we were playing for dinner, were we? Mm -hmm. 15, love. Fifteen all. Well, fifteen thirty. Is uh, time beginning to run out here for Michael Paling? Just a couple of points away now, Adam Hassan. Out. 30 all. Out. That's a vicious slice from Michael Paling. 40, so 30. difficult to get up to. That's a super point to, to win that for Paling. Able to outlast Hassan that time. <laughs> Soft touch eventually to come Game through. Game Paling. Hassan leads three games to two. Second set by one set to love. So disappointed not to get it done there and then. Adam Hassan, but of Good course luck. he will now serve for a place in yet another touch tennis final. He's not best pleased. He was hoping to to tie a bow on this encounter just there and then, but he's going to have to serve for it. And so Mikey Paling just takes a, a sip from a very big water bottle there. Yes, they're enormous, aren't they? Yeah, there's a few of them outside. Entirely sure what um, kind of delay we're going to have between this semi final finishing and the final starting. I wouldn't imagine too long, considering it is nearly half ten. So uh, Adam Hassan may well just have to go straight back into battle immediately. 15, love. May not be the worst thing for Hassan, though. Gives himself a little less time to think about the, uh, the upcoming match against Alex Miotto, someone that we've 
mentioned, doesn't have a particularly good record against. 30, love. Yeah, I think he'd be happy that this semi-final looks as if it's going to be a short one. I don't think he would have gone... Been best please going straight into a, a final, having toiled away against uh, Paling. But this has been really quite simple for Hassan. Take nothing away from Paling. I think he's played some pretty good stuff, but just playing against a player who plays similarly to him. Hassan's just doing it slightly better tonight. And that is almost love. that with uh, opportunities here for Hassan to put the cherry on the icing of the cake. That's a good pick up from Paling. Again, had to quickly 40, get up to that 15. ball. 40-15. Is this the start of a miraculous comeback or just delaying the inevitable? <laughs> the ace good. will do it. And Adam Hassan Game, set and match Alex Hassan. Mianzo, the world number one By and two the sets world to number love. two will four contest one, the four final. Two. Too good for that Mikey is. Paling today. He comes through in straight sets, 4-1, 4-2. Yeah, and I think Hassan is just saying, let's go straight on. So he's making that decision. Miotto's ready to play. He's just waiting in the wings. He's going to come straight out onto court. Hassan with a little bit of a stretch. But I tell you what, that is a pretty clinical semi-final from start to finish. He really did not give much away. And the way he moves around the court, the way he has that... Fantastic finesse and touch and craft around the court. Really is a joy to watch. He, he can put the ball anywhere and from anywhere. He can pass us that one. The ball and I ball. think it's going to be a really fascinating clash of styles here. Yeah. As we see Alex Miotto with that big serve up against Hassan. Who we've seen has so many qualities all Not around the court. Drink. But as we mentioned, he doesn't have a good record oh, no, lovely. against Miotto. I tell you, you what, this was side, uh, you pretty smooth sailing this semi-final. I think the Paling's the played really yeah. well here today. And uh, deep into the night. Done well to get to the semi-finals. Tough group he had earlier in the evening. And he was able to, to come through that group and get to the semi-final. Took a few games <laughs> off uh, Adam Hassan, but I don't think there was really any danger there tonight. But uh, Mikey Paling, great effort tonight. <laughs> So where's but your money here then, Mikey? Well, look, I know the record doesn't look good for, for Hassan, but I, I think he's playing really well tonight. And I think this court perhaps does suit him. He's uh, so good at moving around the court that these tighter spaces perhaps isn't, it's not a major problem for him. Obviously, a lot will depend on whether Alex Miotto just rains down missiles. Look, I'm going to go Adam Hassan. I think he's played the best from start to finish here tonight and that's where I'm gonna put my one pound okay you think he's gonna beat him for just the second time the only other time Adam Hassan has got the better of Alex Miotto back in June earlier this year at the Rackets Masters he came through in straight sets 5-4-4-1 since then though nope, they've met uh, uh, three yeah, more times and it's been Alex Think Miotto every single one of them And just uh, going to get a, a fizzy drink there, say, maybe just a bit of a sugar rush needed. The time I've changed <laughs> is if you both agree. That makes sense? Uh, yeah, I'd like to call them. I'll call them. I'll call all of them. I'm trying to call his service. No, yeah, I'll call all of them. But if, 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 for example, you've both gone the same, yeah. then no, that, no, that's cons fine. this consideration. Yeah, it's tough for the umpire, of course, when Alex Miotto is serving as quickly and as big as he does. Very, very difficult to actually Go be 100% sure whether it has caught the line or not. It's going to serve so, first. Yeah. <laughs> Something that uh, Alex Miotto prefers to do, of course, with that huge weapon of his. So they will just have a little warm up before getting underway. It's a rivalry that only started last year, met for the first time in. 
February last year in Portsmouth. But, uh, well, it just shows how often they make the finals, the semi-final stage, doesn't it? Their last uh, six meetings between each other has come at the final. This now the seventh time. Is that the semi-final? We were, we were at that event, weren't we, in Portsmouth? Last year. There was last year. Year before. Four, Ladies and gentlemen, Four, this is the 2019 right. Masters Cup final. February, to the left of the chair, Adam Hassan. To the right of the chair, yeah. Alex Miotto. <laughs> I, can't, I can't remember. We've definitely, <laughs> been, to We've Portsmouth. definitely been to Portsmouth. Yeah. Adam For Hassan won the toss event. and elected to serve. Yeah, the £1,000 Masters Series event there. I thought it was two years ago, but I might be wrong. Either way, they should know each other like the back of their hands, these two. Adam Hassan's job here is just to try and get into the rally. If he can get into the rally, then you'd uh, probably say that he then becomes favourite. Easier said than done, of course, trying to do so. I mean, the way Miotto was serving in that semi-final against Golic, it will be tricky to get too much change on that on that serve. But Golic did get to kind of 30 all and had his opportunities a few times. And this is where I think Adam Hassan has to take encouragement because he's such a good returner. And when you do get into the rallies, like you said, Adam, I think he's going to have a good chance. But we shall see. Gets so much bounce and, and top spin on the serve, though, does uh, Miotto. It's not easy to lay a racket on it. Ladies and gentlemen, players are ready. Adam Hassan to serve. It's the, the first game. The final. It, it? Yes, the <laughs> final. The world number one, the world number two of the uh, Shiba Coffee Masters Cup. It's Adam Hassan against Alex Miotto. It's Adam Hassan to start us off. Oh. What is that uh, Love sign 15. of things to come? Out. 15 all. The problem is when you play someone with a serve like Alex Miotto's, it just puts that extra bit of pressure on your service game because you know if you are broken, it's going to be very, very tricky to try and break back. Thirty fifteen. Fans on the gallery. The, uh, the other players and Rash is up there as well. All watching this final after a, an excellent few hours of play that we've had here. It's a rally of real quality between Fourth, these two. 40 15. At the moment, you just cannot see Adam Hassan missing. Mm. Yeah. Oh, wow. What a return. 40 30. Yeah, had a good look at that one, Miotto. That was not coming back. Out. That's just why. And this right Juice, away. Sudden is death, a, receiver's a choice. A worrying moment for Hassan. Outside. That's a great angle that Alex Miotto has found with the game backhand. And Miotto. What a start. First game. For the world number one. He breaks straight away. He has hit the ground running, and that's really impressive for Miotto. He's had well, about 20 minutes off, and he's got that break right away. He could not have asked for a better start. And uh, if he can just compound that break of serve with a, a 
clinical service holds here. He will be feeling very good about things in this final. <laughs> 15 well, love. Alex Miotto can do, which Adam Hassan can't. He can just win a service game in about 30 13, seconds love. flat. I mean, it's like a cheat code, isn't it? I mean, yeah. <laughs> it's absolutely <laughs> incredible. But you'd still go with the consistency 40 of love. Hassan's serve. <laughs> <laughs> I might be reconsidering <laughs> it. <laughs> oh, I think he's found that return. I just meant a lefty serve. 40, 15. How about a lefty Miotto? Uh, yeah, I mean, wow. lovely stuff. <laughs> That's oh, enormous. Just the service game, game that Miotto. Uh, Alex Miotto wanted. Backs up Miotto the brink of serve and has raced into a two-love lead. Away. Just wide. Yeah. Love, 15. Something very aesthetically pleasing, just about a singles court, I think, without the tram lines. Yep. Oh wait. Of course, it does mean no doubles on 15 this. Fifteen all. On this court, but yeah, because we were hoping to uh, go to battle on the doubles court. <laughs> <laughs> no one needs to see that. <laughs> That's nice. Bit of a change up with the serve volley. 30-15. Yeah, really good. I think something we should see more from Hassan. Servant volley, outstanding. Bit of good Out. fortune there. 30, sorry, 40-15. Out. Didn't miss by much. 40 30. Now it's too Out. good, it was just long. Juice. Sudden death, receiver's choice. Well, at one Outside. break, he's got half a chance. If he gets the double break, you'd say no chance. Oh, it's enormous. The world number one just asserting his dominance out here. He does Game have the double Nioto. break, and surely Nioto leads he three has games the to love set. First set. That's got to be the, the set in the bag. For Alex Miotto, the way he has been serving all day, all night. It's going to take something very special here for Hassan to, to try and turn this first set around. 35 years of age, Alex Miotto, and looking fresh out there. It's long, Deep. I think. Deep. Oh, there's only been one bagel between these two in their nine previous meetings. It came in Weybridge earlier this year. Alex Miotto taking that second set for love. Out. Well, he's done really well twice now, Hassan, to all. return the serve in this game. He's got his reward this time with a missed volley. He's made three returns now, but... 30-15. Alex Miotto gobbles up the volley.
like self-defense almost 15. for Adam Hassan at times. And that'll do it. Game, Quick Miotto. Quick as a flash. Alex First Miotto set. takes the opening four games set to love. by four games to love. What can Adam Hassan find at, uh, in this second set? That is brutal. Very, very good indeed from uh, Alex Miotto. I did say Hassan was going to win this, didn't I? Still time. There is still time, and he's a really good fighter, Hassan, but that just looked very one-sided. Because even when they got locked into a rally, Miotto was not giving anything away. Breaking the Hassan serve twice, so it looks as if he's got the number of the Hassan serve here tonight. Big game this one, has to win this service game. That's the hardest thing, isn't yeah. it? Is that Adam Hassan serve, he basically has Love to 15. really, really win every single point. Whereas Alex Miotto just steps up to the line, hammers ace after ace. That's wide. Away. Getting more Love and more frustrated 30. and maybe just trying to force the issue a bit now. Yeah. Well, works out this time. Just 15, needs 30. something to swing his way here, Hassan. Really like the way he's just so composed here, Miyato. Hold on. Oh, we've got Rash on the court. Sorting out here. He's always always doing something around the fifteen thirty. <laughs> around the grounds, around the court. It's world class from Adam Hassan. Maybe that is the point that will just get him going. 30 all. It's really high quality. 40 30. This would be a big hold from Adam Hassan if he can come through this. Out. I can't be doing that. That is Juice. a real good Sudden gift. death. Receiver's choice. Outside. Oh, this is must win for Adam Hassan, you feel. It's wide. Out. Game, and Hassan. Hassan does come through. What an imperative First game, that second set. Be. First set, Miotto. That could be absolutely vital, that for Adam Hassan. Just looked in a, a sticky situation there, but that's the first game of this final. That has gone his way. Long way still to go in this. And if he does just slightly take his foot off the gas with this serve, things could just turn on its head. Fifteen love. I mean, what do you do? <laughs> no. 
out. That one's long. I mean, 15 all. that's so impressive from Hassan to get that back. He's jumping up in the air. He's a live wire. Look at that. That's such a, a brilliant return. And again, that's what he's got to do to get the, the serve back. 30-15. Not many players can, to, can get that back. But Hassan, time and time again, is able to just burst into life. Get a racket on it. Again, did really well to make the return. 40-15. A little bit of good luck there for uh, Miotto with the volley. Just massive serving game again. Game, Miotto. One game more. Well, Alex Miotto is pretty difficult to beat on any court, but you feel a court like this with so little room around it just makes him even more difficult to beat. Just the serve that's huge. That forehand isn't bad either. Yeah, set that up so nicely. Just waiting Love for his 15. moment to strike. And that was a, a fine moment to strike. Lots of court to aim at. Hassan not able to get that one back. I think that's where he's having joy. Just pushing Miotto out wide. Time and time again, we've seen that work. Needs to keep on trying to find the angles, both on the forehand and the backhand side of Miotto. It's a big guy, not easy to 30, stretch 15. from one side to the other. Particularly, this is their fifth match of the day for both these players. Three group matches, a semi-final, now this final. That lunging right and left is perhaps the most difficult thing right now. Out. Oh, that's long. 30 all. Just getting increasingly agitated here. Hassan, 30 all. Another half opportunity, this. Absolutely extraordinary touch tennis from Alex Miotto. Oh. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> he wasn't even sure he'd made it. 30 40. <laughs> well, he took a tumble when he, when he put this winner away. I don't know if his, his ankle just gave way, but he's okay. Back up on his feet. I'm sure, feeling a lot better that that was in. And there wow. we go. That's a, a huge moment. Breakthrough Miotto. for Miotto. A set Yoto leads two games to one, and second set, and by one set to love. Man. Yeah, that is uh, almost criminal, really, for Adam Hassan there. Thank you. I felt it fantastic. Thank well, you. look at this from. I mean, he really is a jack of all trades. Well, Rash, isn't he? the creator of this wonderful sport, Touch Tennis, he's just delivered our, our chair umpire, Alan, uh, a Sheba Coffee. That's great. Of course, the, uh, the sponsors, the chief sponsors of this event. And it tastes great, apparently, so. <laughs> <laughs> You're a coffee drinker, aren't you? I am. I'm, I'm a, a little coffee? annoyed that uh, Rash hasn't brought one in here, <laughs> but <laughs> I'll have a word. Sheba coffee smells good. Apparently, it tastes good. So uh, there we go. Out. To be fair, it's warm in this commentary box, and actually, Love it 15. is. Yeah. Alan's, Alan's sitting out there on the court where it is a little bit chilly. Is that hot coffee? Fifteen all. I'm sure, it is just coffee. Nothing stronger. Yeah, it could be Irish. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Friday night. Yeah. Out. Around Christmas time as well. Very merry. You feeling Christmassy yet? Thirty uh, fifteen. Not quite. Are you? I did a Secret Santa. Uh, uh, that'll a few do days it. ago. And I'm feeling it now. What present did you get? 40-15. It was like jokey presents. So <laughs> I got a couple of 
Christmas baubles. One was, they had no meaning. One was a mole, like a little creature. <laughs> I mean, it was nonsense, really. <laughs> 40, 30. So I got someone a colouring book. Nice oh, Harry Potter cool. colouring book. That's what Rash needs to bring out, actually. Some touch tennis baubles. Yeah. Would be nice. Really nice to have on your tree. Game, right Miotto. at the top of the tree. Maybe a, Three a games baby to one. Angel Rash A baby Alex Miotto, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So Either what my girlfriend would say if I brought one of those <laughs> home for, for the top of the tree. Have you done your tree? Have you trees are. The tree's been up for weeks. Okay. Weeks and weeks. Real tree or fake tree? It's fake, I'm afraid. Oh, that's fine. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's fine. Well, I used to be a huge... Sustainable. Love your tree. Yeah. I used to be a huge lover of, of normal trees, but too much hassle. Pack this one up into the loft. We should probably focus on this. Good leaf, yeah. Potentially Love last 30. game. But we're enjoying the chat about Christmas trees as well. well he's just a couple of points away here. Is uh, Alex Miotto. Could be a winning Christmas this for Alex Miotto. Oh, it's lovely. What an angle. 30 all. Well, important here for Hassan just to try and ask the question of Miotto. You never know. It's always that final game, the one that gets you over the line. That's always the hardest to get through. 40 30. Out. Good holds. So he does ask the question of Alex Miotto whether he can serve this one out himself. Game, three Hassan. Two now. Miotto leads three games to two, second set it's by one holds. set to love. Late on this Friday night, Adam Hassan has just pulled that one out of the bag. And he does just ask the question there of Alex Miotto. Can you keep on finding these big serves and oh, get over the finish line yourself? Not giving anything away here, Hassan. I think he will be disappointed, particularly how that first set went, being broken twice. Not getting on the scoreboard at all in that first set, but it's been a, a much improved second set. And now he's just, <laughs> he's just looked up towards the, the guys on the gallery thinking, OK, what do I do here? <laughs> yeah, he always 15 goes that one out wide on the juice side, does Miotto. That's what Hassan's just said. He even knows where it's going, and he still can't get it back into court. Take a bow, Adam Hassan. That is ridiculous. 15-0. 15 oh, he's got another. Hassan is coming to life. 15-30. He is not done yet here. <laughs> Big. Oh, it's in. Yeah, I thought it was in. Well, he wasn't sure, Adam. Hassan, <laughs> that really was Virtual. packed full of pace and power. Yep. Well, there's no doubt about that one. 40 30. Well, it's victory once Game, again. Game, set, a match. Miotto, the world number one, two Alex sets love. Miotto. Four two, four He's two. won his last five tournaments in a row Thank now. In fact, the last time that he didn't make a final was 11 tournaments ago. He is the undisputed world number one, and he comes through in straight sets against Adam Hassan. Four love, four two, and he is the champion here in Guildford. Yeah, really enjoyed this. As, uh, well, I thought Adam Hassan had a... Had a good chance in this final, as, as I said, I did say. I think he, he might have enough here tonight, but oh, there was just no doubt he was going to win this one. He's not happy, Adam Hassan. I think he, I mean, he played better than than winning just two games in that final, but he's come away 4-love, four 4-2. Four That's a bit of a, 
a hammering in this final, and that will certainly disappoint Hassan, who has played so well throughout this evening, but just did not have enough in this final because a a Alex Miotto just a, a different kettle of fish entirely. He really played well tonight, not just the serve. I, we talk about the serve, but I think when you get into the rally, he was rock solid on both wings, getting forward to the net as well. I think all in all, the perfect evening for, for Alex Miotto from start to finish. Well, some of the uh, the highlights here for for Miotto. There were many big booming serves that did the trick for him. Really enjoyable, and he really has dominated here tonight. It's uh, an excellent win for him, and he continues to rock and roll this season. Yeah, quite an extraordinary 2019 for Alex Miotto. As I said, that's five consecutive tournaments that he has come out on top, and he is now the Sheba Coffee Masters Cup champion as well. Four love, four two over Adam Hassan and Miotto walks off court to a nice ovation and he is the man to beat going into 2020 isn't he a great day Mikey yeah really enjoyable from uh, start to finish I think the uh, the event has been brilliant here in the barn we've uh, thoroughly enjoyed this uh, Shiba Coffee Masters Cup some excellent touch tennis throughout the group stages the semi-finals were good fun and this final even though it was fairly one-sided such a high level of play on display all in all wonderful advert for this sport yeah so that brings uh, to an end then our coverage of the Sheba coffee masters cup and the touch tennis season for 2019 we hope you've enjoyed it as much as we have and we will see you all again in 2020 from all of us here it's goodbye <laughs>